And here, now we dig into 10 rules, which I have compiled. What I've done is I looked into all kinds of literature on startup measures. Uh, and I put them all together in 10 steps, 10, 10 items. And the items are to beat the correlation. So this, this is the thing. The correlation was for any process, any way of lack of pretreatment or, or pre preparation or whatever. So it's a really crude correlation. And here I uh, put extract from literature 10 rules to apply so you can beat the correlation. So the first thing is, is your process new? Did you really determine correctly that you are new? So really looking at the design and whether there's anything new there, rather than thinking, ah, thinking, oh, it's a conventional process, nothing is new. If you don't, if you don't uh, establish that you have a new process, then you don't do any of the other things. Eh? You, you just continue as if nothing is new and nothing needs to be done in the preparation. The second thing which we discussed, the integrated downscale pattern. If you need a pilot plan because of the rules, uh, then you should have it. If not, that's a major uh, cause of additional startup problems. Did you integrate the research and development with the contractor knowledge? Is it another very important piece of information to do. And then the number four is, it, are the, is the scale up knowledge for each generation available? So read, really, do you know how to do the scale up for any individual motivation? So that is the, the first four are about say the design and construction stages, and the last six steps are on the startup preparation. Uh, the, the, the number five is did you carry out a potential problem analysis? So you're looking at your uh, startup uh, and you do with a group of people. A potential problem analysis, what could go wrong? How can we take additional uh, measures if things go wrong? So that's the precaution measures. Do you have a complete startup team? Sometimes companies start up without having a startup team. You're asked for trouble if you do so. Did you train your operators for your process or not? And do you have a startup plan? And then document is the last thing. If you don't document, then you ask for trouble again. 